What's good lit and fitters? So today I'm gonna be hitting you guys with some raw hard brain food and it may get offensive so I suggest that if you get offended easily you can get off this video right now it's not for you so let's get on to it the topic of today is gonna be about uh, well specifically drama and uh, in the bigger picture is gonna be idubs versus what's his name rice gum that's right rice gum so uh, let's get on to the main topic now the topic I want to talk about is how that um, you know the, uh, the diss tracks all that uh, the content cup and stuff like that how did it become so popular so fast and uh, believe it or not one of the main reasons is negative vibration energy now think about it when you watch the news and uh, why is it not bright okay when you watch the news and um, if everything for example was always nice and good and world peace was kind of a thing and uh, there was nothing really to talk about on the news would you still watch it I don't watch news that often but when I do it's really all about oh this guy got shot uh, it's gonna be America versus Korea this and that and all like negative stuff and what it is uh, negative stuff it fuels people that negative uh, vibration energy it's very easy digested in uh, the um, <laughs> Hold on, sorry, I'm really sick. My nose is like... Uh, it's very easy to digest for the dopamine brain. The dopamine brain is kind of accumulated to that negative vibration over the years because everything on the news and many things you watch, they're basically negative vibration things. So uh, if you think about it, that... Um, YouTubers like iDubs and RiceGum, they create a large amount of uh, low vibration negative stuff like the uh, diss tracks and stuff like that and because they're already so popular it uh, pretty much becomes it becomes so grand that uh, people start hating on uh, RiceGum and uh, dislikes and all that but they still watch his videos and stuff like that so he still makes money out of it so there's no uh, a uh, win-lose in this situation it's a win-win anyway because uh, rice gum gets his exposure and he gets uh, and then he makes a diss track so it's there's basically no win-lose all right let's get on to the next one now another grand reason why it's very there is a win-win situation there it's because iDubs is a very popular youtuber so is RiceGum and they may not share the same viewers and when these two go into a fight that means these two are pretty much sharing viewers at this point so they're pretty much um, fans of uh, each are pretty much watching others content if they never did and uh, basically both are gaining subscribers from this so that's how basically uh, social media and how uh, youtubers become popular is by other youtubers talking about them which have more subscribers so for example if you want a uh, to become popular online you basically what you gotta do is you need somebody to find a reason to either like you or hate you if they hate you because of that low vibration energy you get more attention that's why controversy is so good on YouTube because uh, when you do something that makes uh, people hate you that's when you pretty much are uh, making all this uh, you're steering controversy which makes people uh, come to your channel because they see others talking about it so it's a very good way 
There's like a dog behind me and he's trying to... I don't know what they're doing. Is that a female? Still he needs a girlfriend. So yeah, I got distracted. Uh, so yeah, when you stir up controversy, it's basically creating... A, it's a unique content and it's also negative vibration energy because you're getting people to either hate on you or support you in this case I don't know am I that dark now it's bright what the hell it's so weird um, so uh, yeah that's another big reason why I dubs and um, oh my god I hate being sick uh, that's why I dubs and rice gum are basically in a win-win situation here and uh, yeah so when I talk about negative energy negative vibration energy that kind of thing is what our society is extremely fueled of it pretty much rules the world at this point because no matter where you go it's all about that even if you look at people who claim to be all positive and spreading positivity they still do shit to uh, kind of uh, to spread the controversy to get more viewers if you know what I mean so basically if you want to become popular at uh, any point you gotta do something that will piss some people off and then they will make a video about you and even if you're a good person in general you'll gain uh, followers because they just made a video about you and they claim how uh, oh my god again they claim how you're a shitty human being in general but then you go on the YouTube channel you kind of are a good person that's how like when you look at uh, rice gum and you look at his in his uh, recent videos he seems like a pretty decent dude but then you look at the, what uh, I dubs kind of uh, when, uh, when you look at the, what iDubs is talking about, it seems like uh, Rice Gum is basically a sinner and uh, he talks about how rape is good and stuff like that, which is true, which was like so long ago, but at the same time, it's, uh, it's attracting subscribers. Why? Because they, that uh, negativity keeps them neg negativity keeps them uh, interested in uh, the person so they start subscribing and uh, pretty much yeah that's that's how people get famous and you see on the news they start uh, publicizing people who uh, do negative things you know like people who uh, like terrorists and stuff like that and those people get popular and they get popular for the wrong reasons. They get popular for kind of, uh, you know, for uh, being, I don't know what happened, my video kind of stopped. But uh, as I was saying, people on the news, they get popular for the wrong reasons. Because uh, if like somebody does a terrorist act, he all of a sudden becomes popular and people start researching him. And if he has any social media, they start looking at his stuff and that's how they get it, gain attention. And also, if you look at CNN, you look at, uh, what do you think Donald Trump became president? If uh, somebody, like, you look at Donald Trump and all the horrible things he said on uh, cam, and that's basically the fuel for the dopamine brain. You see it, they see that uh, negative vibration energy, and the brain is basically enjoying that, he's enjoying the fact that Trump is not doing something like all the other politics. Is it good now? Okay. So they're seeing how Donald Trump is not doing the same thing as uh, all the other politics. So what he uh, is fueling that negative, uh, negative negativity in your brain that is lacking from the politicians that are now. For example, like uh, if you see, at, uh, if you look at Barack Obama, every time he's on camera, he's like a kind of a good person when he talks he like all he wants is like positivity and people kind of get bored of that and now when Trump comes in all you see is this guy talking about how he grabbed women and stuff like that 
and uh, you know he became popular for pretty much uh, saying all this you know all this dirt and that's what people actually wanted and that's why ha almost half of America voted for Trump so yeah that's another uh, big uh, proof that people are fueled by negativity and uh, yeah so I don't want you guys to feel bad I mean it's not uh, it's not your fault that uh, negativity ne oh my god because my nose is stuffed I can't say negativity which is pretty funny uh, anyways so yeah that's what I wanted to say that uh, negative vibration is what uh, what people want you know that's what that's how the uh, victim mentality became uh, so uh, popular so okay let's talk about the victim mentality now if you look at the victim mentality for example when uh, I dubs uh, the dog is stuck okay when uh, I dubs made that uh, content cup on uh, rice gum what that did is caused the uh, it caused rice gum oh my god don't you hate when your dog just like goes through the random place where you can't go through and then you're gonna you know uh. yeah anyways so uh, he made a video about kind of explaining what uh, items was talking about and he was kind of like you know complaining and crying out that you know like he's changed and everything and that's basically a victim mentality and what that did for him is uh, create like you know he created a lot of haters the people who understood who don't like that victim mentality but at the same time you know those uh, the uh, people the social justice warriors and uh, the uh, what's the name anyways like you know there's a lot of people in this world who aren't really they don't have their own opinion so instead if they hear somebody crying they just kind of roll with it and they're like okay he's right it was so long ago and blah 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 and uh, they like the video and they comment we still love you rice gum and stuff like that so that victim mentality is also very very popular which is steered by negative vibration energy and you know it's very divided though like some people like it some people kind of uh, they know it's kind of bullshit and they're trying to you know the people who want to raise above that low vibration energy and become high vibration energy they can spot this victim mentality and uh, you know become more kind of awoke to it and have their own opinions and you know and always kind of uh, be one step ahead of the ones who don't so yeah that's uh oh my god so you're killing me okay uh so my my uh like overall opinion is what uh i dubs and rice gum did is genius in terms of attracting the masses because that's basically what the uh, modern society wants it wants that uh, low vibration energy and that's why it gets so much views and that's why people who are uh, like you know people who are more enlightened or woke quote unquote are not very uh, popular on YouTube like the people who talk about nofab the RSD for example real social dynamics they will never kind of reach that type of fame because they don't uh, really preach that uh, low vibration energy instead they kind of do like they uh, kind of uh, fight against it in the terms so uh, yeah that's basically it for the vlog hope you enjoyed hit that like button hit that subscribe button and yeah let me know what you think about it in the uh, comment section below Peace.